What is up guys? Welcome to another fall time musky fishing video. Um, yeah, it is late fall now. I'm going to just show you guys a little clip that um, I shot yesterday. Yeah, the lake I wanted to fish yesterday is completely frozen over. I mean, there's not many lakes you can fish right now. There's only a couple bodies of water that are open right now. And uh, yeah, that's the season is coming to a very quick end. I can't believe it. Uh, the bite's been kind of slow. He's been out guiding a, f a few days in the last week, and he's been able to um, scrape up a couple muskies, a couple first muskies actually, uh, on the sucker on a sucker program. So the weatherman said it was going to be 36 degrees today, but at the moment it's only like 30, 31 degrees. So it's going to make casting a little hard. But I'm going to set up two suckers, and one and I'll be casting. I'm by myself today. Michael might join me later. I don't know yet, but uh, yeah, that's that's. Well, we got, it's kind of getting hard to get content for you guys now that the season is getting colder and colder. I can't believe ice fishing's almost here. It just, it's just way too soon. So yeah, wish me luck guys. Uh, hopefully bag a muskie here shortly. Just a brief interruption for today's video. Guys, the muskie shop is doing a Black Friday sale, which means 15% off all in-store items, which means reels, line, I mean, baits, anything you can imagine that's in stock is gonna be 15% off from November 22nd through the 26th. So this starts Thursday, Thanksgiving, through Monday, Cyber Monday. Guys, if you got a musky angler in your life that you wanna get some gifts for Christmas, please check this deal out. This wraps up the little service announcement, and now back to the video. Well, guys, I think it's safe to say that um, it is way too cold to be fishing. <laughs> yeah, that's the bottom of my boat. It's a wonderful ice rink. I should have some ice cleats on the, some ice fishing cleats on there. Uh, moment of truth, suckers are still alive. That's a, that's a good thing. What I'll be running today is two, two smaller suckers. Not nothing, nothing like Michael. What Michael uses in uh, northern Wisconsin. Wow, I don't have a net. This really sucks. All right, here's the first victim. Oh, that's like a nine-inch sucker, ten-inch sucker. Definitely not big. I'm gonna run a couple of those. Here's the rig. Little homemade nose clip. Slide that in there, nice and easy, just like that. Since the sucker is so small, just only running one, one. Um, one treble there, kind of like what we do for pike. So it's the perfect size sucker right there. Get them close to the bottom. And then I'll be setting up another one. Oh, I hope the muskies are doing things today. I need to catch one. All right, guys, gonna be running something a little different today. Got myself a Rapala Husky Jerk gear, size 14. Um, yeah, everyone talks about big giant baits in the fall. Well, today I'm gonna try super small finesse approach. It's worked for me in the past, so we're gonna try it today. Got my personal best pike on this. Little upsize of the hooks, and I take out the middle hook that is usually there. I put stronger split rings on, and uh, yeah, just beef it up a little bit. It's a great musky bait, just, just needs a little, little better hardware, and then you're good to go. Well, that didn't last long. First reel was frozen in like the first 25 minutes, but that is okay. I brought a spinning rod combo that um, should work just fine. Oh, fish on, fish on. Okay guys, fish on, on the husky jerk. Come on, be a musky, be a musky. No, I don't know what it was. 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 Oh, I, I got a glimpse of it. It was pretty dang small. Wow, it was pretty light. Really looked like a muskie. Oh, just getting to 11.45 here. Almost noon. I would have loved to get a better look of what I just lost, but that didn't take very long. But, uh, yeah, losing losing whatever you... I. It wasn't bigger than 32 inches is what I'm saying. So it's either a decent pike or a small muskie. I don't know. Pretty sure that was a ski though. Oh, nice muskie just came in. Nice muskie just came in. Come on, come back, come back. Literally three or four casts after I just lost that fish. Okay, probably nice meaning, I don't know, 40, 40 inches or so. Come on, I need a muskie, need a muskie. 
would be really fun on this light gear, that's for sure. This husky jerk can be so deadly on every species. Come back on to it. Oh, he's on it, 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 he's on it. Come on, come on, bite it, bite it, bite it, bite it, bite it, bite it, bite it. Fat guy, fat guy. He wasn't that nice, I should say, but he was so fat. He was like a 36 incher, but so flipping fat. I got the sucker right there, kind of moved it up. Ah, okay, that's cool. Moving muskies are cool. Got him, got him, fish on, fish on. Nice musky, nice musky. All right, come on, stay on, baby. Oh yeah. Using that small bait program. <laughs> They're jumping in November. They're jumping in November, how cool. This is a small musky, but I'm gonna net them anyways. There we go, musky aboard. That is what I'm talking about. Small musky, but a musky aboard. Oh man, that was fun. It's so fun on that light gear. I mean, geez. And just like that, that fight was only like 20 seconds. So that was cool. Get this guy unhooked and uh, catch another one. Okay, musky aboard. Um, not a big one, obviously. It's a small one, but hey, on the small bait program, it's almost the end of the year. I don't know how many more times we're gonna get out musky fishing. So every musky is a good musky this time of year. So gonna get him out of the bag and uh, show him off. All right, let's get him out of the water. This is the dangerous size musky here. <laughs> Literally, I don't even know if he's 30 inches, but look how fat this little guy is. Holy crap. He liked that little husky jerk. Um, yeah, this is a dangerous size musky. Razor sharp teeth, but just a pork chop of a musky. I mean, fat, fat, fat. The awesome thing about this time of year is they release awesome. So uh, just gonna pop him back in the water, just like so. Oh, just get upright. Sorry, little guy. All right, goodbye. <laughs> That was cool. One musky so far. Can I get a double musky day? We will see, we will see. I thought I pressed the record button. Wow, that's pretty embarrassing, people. I guess I gotta catch another one. That's pretty unbelievable, but kind of believable. Wow, that sucks. Oh no, just freaking lost another one. No, no, that's, oh, that sucks. Dang it, that felt good. Come on, still be down there. Bite it again, bite it again, bite it again. Oh my gosh, that thing smoked it. That's one for three today. Oh, that sucks. Casting this time of year. I mean, that's I'm getting the opportunities. Just not, oh, not getting them. That sucks. Okay, well, um, Michael's actually joining me today, and I see him at the boat launch. Gosh, another bite on the on the husky jerk. I have a visitor from the Northwoods. Michael's back. Um, your boat's looking a little salty. <laughs> so bad. <laughs> he drove through snow to get back to Madtown, but um, we're actually gonna make a barge right now. We're gonna hook up Michael's boat to my boat. Uh, the reason Michael's boat is here right now, that's for another video that hopefully happens. That's to be determined, but Michael's gonna start fishing with me here shortly. All right, we are officially a two deep V pontoon boat. Wow. Um, so that means we have to put sucker rods on that side of the boat. Wow, this is crazy. I liked not having service way better. <laughs> got him, got him, fish on. Fish on, all right. <laughs> it feels pretty small though, but it, it could be a musky. Yeah, I think it is. Michael, why don't you get out of your boat and hop into my boat and not this musky for, oh, uh, it is? No, just a gator. Not a bad gator though. Oh, 
much yeah might as well it's much bigger than the muskie i caught earlier i'm a fat gator all right of course I'll always land the gators when they bite but you lose the muskies but okay fish in the boat okay it's a fat pike aboard but it is not a muskie but it is a nice fat pike on the husky jerk but um yeah not the right species but that's okay it's still fun he is going to kick off rather fast, I bet. Okay, bye-bye. On to the next one. Only a couple more hours of sunlight left. So, let's go. Oh, fish, 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 fish. On your rod, your rod, your rod. Look at him. Oh, wow. Mega boat. Wow. <laughs> We're on Michael's boat here. I think I'm good hook setting pretty much anywhere. But yeah, it's going out away from you. Got her? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, you got to be kidding me. <laughs> what the heck, dude? That sucks. Well, there's Mr. Gator again. That's lovely. Is that what you dreamed was on the end of that line? Oh, and there you go there. Sucker, Sucker everything. There wow. He is. <sighs> you got the sucker at least. <laughs> Circle hooks do not kill fish if you do it correctly. Especially these small ones. There we go. Nice bike though. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Not what we're really looking for, but man, Sad. beautiful. Well, guys, that wraps up today's video of, um, you know, using a little different tactic for muskies in the late fall. Not all about giant baits in the fall sometimes. Uh, I definitely could have had a better day. Lost a couple, couple fish. Got one dink muskie in the boat. A couple pike. But, um, yeah, this wraps up today's video. But Michael and I here are going to try to try to do a different video. Uh, nighttime fishing um, hopefully it goes well we don't know if there's gonna be a video to that obviously hopefully we can get some muskies to bite but um, all I know is it's really cold outside there's only a few more days really left of the season of casting um, I don't know hopefully we can catch some more fish this, this year but thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you on the next video